Members of the media, including myself, filled Floyd Mayweather's Las Vegas boxing gym today. It is typical for the undefeated former five-division world champion to open his gym to journalists on a specified day ahead of his fights. However, the bout he's training for now is anything but typical. Should Mayweather beat UFC star Conor McGregor in their boxing match August 26th, there's more in it for Mayweather than just more millions and millions of dollars. In your heart and mind, would a win over Conor McGregor merit a 50-0 record to beat Rocky Marciano? Uh, Rocky Marciano is a legend. I take my hat off to Rocky Marciano. Guys like Marciano, Ali paved the way for me to be where I'm at. Uh, I just want to go out there and, and, and fight and just be at my best. Is that a yes or a no? It's, it's exactly what I said, sweetheart. Last time that you did retire, you mentioned it was because partly you wanted to protect your brain and your body from future damage. What is it about this fight that makes that not as important? Um, you know, like I said before, I can contradict myself, so I don't know what I said. Uh, that far back, you know, I'm, I'm not perfect. Do you think McGregor's able to inflict any serious harm on you? I mean, I mean, he's a bigger guy. He says he's a heavy hitter. Uh, youth is on his side. He's in his 20s. I'm in my 40s. So we'll just have to see. How much of that is you selling the fight? Um, I'm just giving. I'm just giving you my honest opinion, you know, about what I think. I got to work Floyd out a bit before he actually did his workout. Vegas Insider has Mayweather as the 7-1 to favorite. If he wins, he will surpass the late great Rocky Marciano's record of 49-0 to have 50 wins and no losses. Four wins and eight losses. That was the UNLV football team's record last season. Five is the over-under on how many games the team will win this season and one reason Behind sports books increased optimism. New quarterback Armani Rogers. After redshirting his freshman year, the 6'5, 225 pound signal caller is working on his leadership skills at preseason camp. I feel like I have to uh, do a little bit more becoming a leader, but uh, as far as a freshman quarterback, the, everybody looks up to the quarterback. So I don't feel like just because I'm a freshman that they don't look at me as a leader. I have to go out there, keep my head high, keep the energy up, all that type of stuff, get everybody stay, to stay focused. And finally tonight, the Las Vegas 51s can hold their heads high after what they did tonight. Facing a sweep by rival Reno, they remained focused and rallied from a 7-5 deficit. Matt Reynolds tying the game with that RBI into the hole here. Kevin Flewecki placing one in left field. A two-run double down the left field line, lifting the 51s to a 9-7 lead. And that is the score they would win. That's all for sports. We'll be right back.